So my dudes, Valk here, and today I'm going to be talking about a thing that you guys keep asking me in the comments. I get asked a lot of questions about this. Am I going to make a video about specific dramas? Now, before I get into this video, you guys will be like, But Valk, you're a hypocrite. You did the Great Genshin War in that meme about drama. Let me clarify each of those situations, because those are different compared to what you guys are asking me to make videos on now. Um... Those situations, Great Genshin War was Mahoyo versus Leakers, Leakers versus Leakers, and it affected everyone. Look at how Mahoyo does leaks and everything now, and everything moving forward. I felt and I felt it important to put that information out there because it affected me, you, and everybody else. Um, and also, it I memed it a lot, and it wasn't any particular person involved. Nobody really got hurt in it. It was more so just a situation that was I was covering. And then the meme video, the skit I did, making fun of how drama tends to happen the last two weeks of every update, I was making fun of happenstance. I was making fun of how drama consistently happens in the last two weeks of every update, which is a dry period. And I was saying how maybe it's Mahoyo coordinating the drama to entertain us. That's what I was doing. I wasn't doing that solely uh, to sp talk about specific situations that could or could not have been happening at that point in time. I was doing that to meme the happenstance of the continuous cycle of four weeks of content, two weeks of nothing, and then there's drama in the two weeks before the next update. That's all I was doing. Um, so, in that regard, no, I do not upload drama videos on specific uh, situations. Like, I'm sure you guys know, I don't want to say names because I don't want to tie anything like that to this video. This video is purely addressing comments. But there is certain stuff going down right now with a certain YouTuber, and everyone's... And his name right now is on everyone's lips. The reason I don't want to do this, and the reason I don't want to make videos like that, I don't want to make drama videos, is... Aside from monetizing, even if I was to make it and not monetize it, I would still profit off of it. Because right now, if you were to search a certain YouTuber's name, and you were to go look... Um, you will see a lot of videos of people giving their takes on him. Whether they're monetized or not is irregardless. They're still profiting off somebody else's suffering. Now, do I have an issue with other people doing that? No, I'm not them. I can't control them. I can't instill my morals into other people and expect them to follow them. The only person I can control is myself. And if I don't agree with something, the only person I can make not do it is me. So the only thing I'm going to do is not make those videos myself. If other people want to make them, that's perfectly fine. That's up to them. But, for me, I think it's not good to try to profit off somebody else's suffering. I don't like that. I'm not that person. And I will never do that. So, as long as I feel like there is a specific situation going on, if it does not personally involve me where I feel I need to address something, I'm not going to make a video on it. Because I'll still, like, Solidified. outside of monetary value between monetization of those videos, you're still going to be able to generate clicks. You're going to be able to get subscribers to your channel that could watch future videos You're going to, that will be monetized. You're going to be able to generate a lot of growth and revenue in different ways. Money isn't the only way to gain money. There is other ways to do it. There's other ways to grow. Now, for, like, certain channels that are just gigantic that don't need it, I think they're just looking for content to talk about because the game's so dry, which, in that case, I understand. The game is really dry. It's hard to be a content creator for Genshin Impact during these days and upload on a consistent basis, so the algorithm doesn't say F you and instead promotes your videos to the top. I get how it is. I get it's a struggle. Trust me, I know. But, at the same time, like I said... To me, that's profiting off somebody else's suffering, and I don't like that. That's not me. So I will never do those videos. I will never talk about it. If you guys want to know my opinion on specific situations like that, then just go ask me on Twitch where I'm not profiting off of it, where there's not a search engine dedicated to certain people's names, so whenever specific drama goes down, um, that they won't, that anything I do won't pop up. I just want to make sure nothing I do pops up whenever somebody searches specific names. But this is basically just me addressing not situations. This entire video is not me addressing any situation. This is addressing you guys, the commenters, because you guys keep asking me about my opinions on stuff. Just go ask me on Twitch, dude. I'll answer I'll answer whatever questions you have about drama stuff on Twitch. So yeah, that's basically the video. 
Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Although, I'm going to be real, this is a moral thing, so if you guys think Stabilize. you should talk about the drama, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> I'm just not going to do it. Other than that, thank you guys all for watching, as always. Hopefully, this makes sense to you guys about why I avoid some topics. Um, hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. I will catch you guys next time. Peace.